talking to a guy for two months now that he has the beer bug, how is he is not communicating? I don't know how to handle this, please. Well, if he's not communicating with you, you're not going to, there's not a whole lot that you can do, right? You've been talking to a guy for a couple months. Well, my suggestion is you stop getting attached to men that you haven't met in real life. That is my first suggestion. I have a video about how to detach yourself from men. My suggestion is that you start with that. And my second suggestion is to stop getting overly attached to guys. Stop investing in guys. Stop spending tons of time thinking about and emotionally connecting to guys that who aren't really... Um, you, you know, that you haven't even met yet, you know? It's a huge red flag, right, for yourself. You need to look at a big red flag for yourself saying, I've been talking to this guy for two months and I'm losing my mind because he's not communicating. That should be a big red flag for yourself in saying, wow, um, maybe I need to diversify where I'm getting my connection and where what kind of options that I have and you know putting all my eggs in this scarcity basket of this one dude right because this is so a lot of women complain about this idea that I call abundance right it's this idea where you uh, it, specifically abundance of options where you're connecting with and talking to and dating multiple men at the same time, usually up to three, don't hook up with any of them. And they complain about this a lot because it, you know, they just want this one guy and it's this one guy and I want to make him like you, you know, make him like me and whatever. But um, here's the problem with what ha what's happening is you get into situations like yours where your only option is this one dude and he stops communicating with you and you're freaking out and you shouldn't be, right? You haven't even met this guy. You're not even in a relationship with this guy. You're you're not even you don't even know if this I mean, I don't know how much you even know about this person. He might be real, he might not be real. Who knows what's going on with this guy? And so you don't want to be in a situation like the one that you're in. And so my suggestion is that you detach from this guy as quickly as you possibly can, build some abundance and stop making it all about this one dude.